Hello everyone, welcome to Aptitude Jab. This set from CAT 2020, slot 2 DILR, says that there is a chain of departmental stores. It has outlets in four cities, Delhi, Mumbai, Bengaluru and Kolkata. The sales are categorized by its three departments, apparel, electronics and home decor. An accountant has been asked to prepare a summary of the 2018 and 2019 sales amounts for an internal report. So we are given some of the data, some data is missing and we are given additional information to fill the remaining data and answer these questions. Now for electronics department, the entire data is available. We have home decor and apparels. Now it has eight statements given to us and we need to fill in the data. Now, uh, what should be an optimum way to solve such questions is, see, there are some of these statements that talk about apparel, right? And some of them talk about the home decor, okay? So classify those statements like apparel 1, 2, statement number 4, okay, then 7 and then 8, they talk about any one, uh, uh, like these talk about the apparel ones and 5, 6 and 3. 3, 5 and 6 talk about the home decor department, okay? And if you see, more data is available for home decor, more data is available and fewer information is needed to complete it. So choose the statements that talk about home decor. Don't just blindly start with statement number 1. So let us first home, uh, film home decor first, that will give us the confidence that we are able to fill the data into this table okay so uh, we have three and six that are talking about the home decor it says the sales amounts in the home decor departments were the same for mumbai and kolkata in 2018 okay so mumbai kolkata same value and then we are given that the total sales of the four home decor departments increased by 70 crores okay there's an increase of 70 crores and the sales amount in Delhi and Bengaluru increased by 20 crores each. So Delhi and Bengaluru, it increased by 20 crores. So that means that Delhi was at 80 and Bengaluru was at 60. So 80, 60, 40 crore increase is done, right? Now, uh, that means the other two, like Mumbai and Kolkata increase will be 30 crore right they have given that uh, that is uh, the total increase is 70 crores from statement number 5 a statement number 6 that delhi and bengaluru saw an increase of 20 crore so mumbai and kolkata will collectively have an increase of 30 crores so now 72 plus 54 126 final is 126 that means mumbai and kolkata was 96 it increased by 30 it became 126 okay so this is the total is 96 now coming to the point point number three it says sales amount in home decor were same for mumbai and kolkata in 2018 so 96 is the total that means we will have 48 and 48 now filling this much of information would give a person some confidence into the set and also probably will help answer some of the questions now we will move on to the apparel part it is quite tricky one. It contains a lot of information. It says the sales amounts in the apparel departments were the same for Delhi and Kolkata in 2018. So let's say Delhi and Kolkata. Let's put the values as A. Then it says the sales amounts in the apparel departments were the same for Mumbai and Bangalore in 2018. So let us say these values are B. Mumbai and Bangalore B. This sales amount matched the sales amount of the apparel department for Delhi in 2019. So this means that this is also B. Okay, so we have filled some information. Now, we need to have uh, 4, 7 and 8. Fourth statement says the sum of the sales amounts of the four electronic departments increased by the same amount as the sum of the sales amount of four apparel departments from 2018 to 19. So we know the data about electronic department, find the increase, this is increase of 20, this is increase of 20, decrease of 20 and increase of 20. So that means fourth statement says that in apparel department, 
there is an increase of 40 crores along four of them complete together. Then point number seven says the sales amounts in the apparel departments of Delhi and Bengaluru each increase by the same amount, right? What is the increase in Delhi? Increase in Delhi is B minus A. Okay, that will be the increase in so increase in Delhi is equal to increase in Bangalore. That will be equal to B minus A. Okay, that is one piece of information. And the sales amount in the apparel department of Mumbai and Kolkata also increased by the same amount. So Mumbai increase will be equal to increase in Kolkata. What is the increase in Kolkata? 54 minus A. Okay. Now, can we find out the uh, new amount in Mumbai? So, Mumbai, the amount was B and it increased by 54 minus A. So, that means 54 plus B minus A. That is the final amount here. And in Bangalore, the increase is B minus A. So, B plus B minus A, 2B minus A. So, these are the values that we will get. Now, the next thing is point number 8. The sales amount in the apparel department of Delhi, Kolkata and Bangalore in this order followed arithmetic progression. Delhi, Kolkata and Bangalore, they form an AP. So that means B, 54 and 2B minus A, right, are in AP. So these are in AP, that is the information and we have uh, this information that total apparel increases 40 crores. So these are the two pieces of information remaining with us. Okay. Now what we will do is, first of all find the total increase. Okay. So these are the two increases. So uh, total increase will be, uh, if you add these two, we will get 54 plus B minus 2A. 54 plus B minus 2A. So, this is for, we will multiply it by 2. Why 2? Because this is for one of the cities. For two cities, it will be double. And for this, it will be double. So, that into 2 is total increase is 40 crore. Okay. Or we can say that half of this will be 20. That is a simpler thing to do. Add this. So, Delhi is increasing by some amount. Mumbai is and Kolkata increasing by some amount. Total increase is 40, divide by 2, we get 20. Okay, this is one equation. And these are in AP. So, we know that the central term is the average of these two. So, we get 3B minus A is equal to 108. Okay, so, that's other two pieces of information. So, first equation, let us write in some proper format. That is 2A minus B is equal to 34. And second equation is 3B minus A is equal to 108. Now we shall solve these two equations. Equation number 1 and equation number 2. Uh, if we multiply, uh, we need to find A and B. So uh, let's multiply the smaller one by 3. So we get 6A minus 3B is equal to 102. And we have 3B minus A is equal to 108. Right? So on addition, we get 5A is equal to 210. Okay, or A is equal to 42. So, we get A is 42. We can put here 3B minus 42 is 108. 3B is 150. B is 50. So, A 42 and B 50. Now, since there are too many equations and all, we will just confirm using this also. 2A is 84 minus 50, 34. So, these are the values that we will get for the two numbers. Okay. Now we will put A and B and we will get the final table for this. So A is 42. Let's put 42 everywhere, wherever A is present. And B is 54. So 50, 50, 50. 54 plus B minus A. B minus A is 8. So this will be 58. And 2B is 100 minus 42 will be 58. Now we can check there is an increase of 8. 
there is an increase of 8 that should be uh, one of them we made a mistake right it says that uh, increase is uh, maybe while calculating we made a mistake here delhi and bengaluru increase by the same amount so that will be 50 and 58 this would be uh, mumbai should be 62 okay it should be 62 increase of 12 Okay, maybe while uh, writing this, we made a mistake here. Mumbai and Kolkata, there is an increase of 12. So, total increase will be 40 crores in these. Okay, so uh, now let us answer the questions based on this data. So, this is the data that we got, right? So, we see that the increase is same 8, 8, it is increases 12, 12 this value equals to this value okay that was given to us and uh, these two values are equal and same as delhi for 2019 so that was the information which was given and we filled it making uh, uh, making two equations and that arithmetic progression thing also worked for us 50 54 and 58 okay now let us answer these questions so the first question says that uh, in home decor departments, which cities were the sales amount the highest in 2018 and 2019? So, home decor 2018, the highest was uh, in Delhi and in 2019 also in Delhi. Okay. Now, this could have been answered by filling the, without even filling the table because we were given that, uh, like this was obviously the highest. 2019 so we could have eliminated uh, all one of friends and then like this was figured out quite early in the set so one could have answered this easily what was the increase in sales amount in crore rupees in the apparel department of mumbai from 2018 to 2019 so in mumbai the increase is, 2000, uh, is of 12 crores and uh, among the all 12 departments that is three departments in each of the four cities what was the maximum percentage increase in sales amount from 2018 to 19? So, maximum percentage increase will happen when you have uh, like small amount and increasing by a significant number. Okay, now here the increase was apparels, we figured out the increase was 8 or 12, right? So, uh, that is one of the things. Now, if you look at this, here the increase is 20. 2020 20, and this was also 20 increase 20 with respect to 78 is significant number here the increase is 20 24 20 and 6 so if you notice this this is a very significant increase increase of 24 crores only on 48 crores so that answer is 50 percent what was the total sales amount in 2019 for the chain of departmental stores so we need to add all these values and get the answer okay let's see if we can do it without uh, doing the calculation we will have to do some approximation see one uh, one way is to calculate exact since the values are a bit far apart we can do approximation so this is 200 roughly 250 okay this is roughly uh, 130 and 230 okay this is uh, roughly 210 this is roughly 210 okay so 210 200 420 420 plus 480 that is 900 so we did rough approximation to get the values as 900 now in this set this question and uh, probably this question could have been answered by filling only the home decor part these required you to do fill a lot of data and could have been skipped. So there were four questions. It was better to attempt a set which had six questions and was probably easier than this set in the paper.